Hello welcome to Objective Question Answer MCQ's YouTube channel. With a positive vibes let's start this video. Question number 1. The form of energy that flows from a hot object to a cold object is called, dash. Option A temperature. Option B thermometer. Option C heat. Option D light. The right answer is option C. Heat. The form of energy that flows from a hot object to a cold object is called heat. Question number 2. The heat in metals is conducted by the process of Option A radiation. Option B convection. Option C absorption. Option D conduction. The right answer is option D. Conduction. The heat in metals is conducted by the process of conduction. Question number 3. The degree of hotness or coldness in a substance is called, dash. Option A temperature. Option B thermometer. Option C heat. Option D light. The right answer is option A. Temperature. The degree of hotness or coldness in a substance is called temperature. Question number 4. Glass, plastic, wood are examples of Option A. Insulator. Option B. Conductor. Option C. CONV actors. Option D. Radiators. The right answer is option A. Insulator. Glass, plastic, and wood is examples of insulators. Question number 5. In solid, transfer of heat can take place by, dash. Option A. Conduction. Option B. Convection. Option C. Both conduction and convection. Option D. None of these. The right answer is option A. Conduction. In solid, transfer of heat can take place by conduction. Question number 6. At night, how do the temperatures of land and water compare? Option A. They are of the same temperature. Option B. Land is warmer. Option C. Water is warmer. Option D. It depends on the type of land. The right answer is option C. Water is warmer. At night, water is warmer. Question number 7. The transfer of energy between objects that are in physical contact is by, dash. Option A conduction. Option B convection. Option C radiation. Option D. None of these. The right answer is option A. Conduction. The transfer of energy between objects that are in physical contact is by conduction. Question number 8. Freezing point of water is. Option A 20 degrees Celsius. Option B 0 degrees Celsius. Option C 10 degrees Celsius. Option D 4 degrees Celsius.
The right answer is option B. 0 degree Celsius. Freezing point of water is 0 degree Celsius. Question number 9. Which of these is a conductor of heat? Option A wood. Option B paper. Option C copper. Option D plastic. The right answer is option C. Copper. Copper is a conductor of heat. Question number 10. Temperature is measured with the help of Option A ammeter Option B voltmeter Option C barometer Option D thermometer The right answer is option D Thermometer Temperature is measured with the help of thermometer Question number 11. Which of these is an insulator? Option A copper. Option B wood. Option C iron. Option D silver. The right answer is option B. Wood. Among these, wood is an insulator. Question number 12. Thermos flask keeps hot liquid hot and cold liquid cold by Option A preventing heat loss Option B heating Option C cooling Option D Using coolant The right answer is option A Preventing heat loss Thermos flask keeps hot liquid hot and cold liquid cold by preventing heat loss. Question number 13. Heat from the sun reaches us due to Option A radiation Option B conduction Option C convection Option D vibration The right answer is option A. Radiation. Heat from the sun reaches us due to radiation. Question number 14. When matter gets warmer, the atoms and molecules in that matter, dash. Option A stand still. Option B move faster. Option C move slower. Option D can't say. The right answer is option B. Move faster. When matter gets warmer, the atoms and molecules in that matter move faster. Question number 15. Conduction, convection, and radiation are Option A process through which heat transfers. Option B scales of temperature. Option C different forms of energy. Option D types of thermometer. The right answer is option A. Process through which heat transfers. Conduction, convection, and radiation are process through which heat transfers. Thank you so much for watching our videos. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel Objective Question Answer MCQs. And always remember, never stops learning, because life never stops teaching.